je passerai pas ma vie derrière les barreaux à cause de vous. Dans la Tourmente, In Tourmente, is a French thriller which explores many of the social issues, cutbacks, poverty, brutal job outsourcing at play in France at the moment. Directed by Christophe Rougier, the film stars Clovis Cognac, Ivan Attal and Mathilde de Seigné. The head of an arms factory is preparing to relocate jobs without his workers' knowledge. He also expects to share in kickbacks worth millions of euros. This film is called In Torment, Social Torment, but also the torment of the characters who find their situation running away with them. This is the genre of film that I particularly like, a political or social thriller about people who are effectively tormented because they're living something extraordinary, really out of the ordinary, but on the other hand, people who are very grounded. So for me, it's heart-in-the-mouth action cinema, which also makes us think. I like that idea. Son of a factory worker, director Christophe Rougier says he knows what he's talking about. I think my film poses quite a fundamental question in today's two-speed society, which relies on rules which are respected by the poorest, by the weakest. And we've seen that since 2008, it's striking in any case, there's an awareness of all that, even if we know that's been the case for ages, that the rich don't respect the same rules. It's a question of morals. I think this question is at the heart of what's happening today, for the past three years. It also echoes a book, Insurrection is Coming, which was written several years ago, which sparked much debate. The author's analysis of the situation was exactly right, as can be seen by what happened in the following years. Était d'une justesse absolue puisqu'on a bien vu ce qui s'est passé dans les années qu'on suivit. Everything conspires against friends Frank and Max, played by Ivan Attal, who'd lost everything in the previous restructuring: his job, home, and wife. He's angry, desperate, scared, and dangerous. I have the impression your character is something of a white knight, but very quickly he finds himself weighed down. Is that because he doesn't want to become like his friend Max? I find Franck's character very touching because, in the end, he's like us. And I think he's a great guy, solid, who, in fact, at the crucial moment where he finds himself abandoned a bit, rather than becoming a victim, chooses to do something which is not a good idea, that's for sure. But in the hope it will change things. Mais dans l'espoir de changer quelque chose. The tension mounts progressively and the film moves from the social crisis to a manhunt in the Calanque, the inlets near Marseille. In Torment goes on general release in France and Belgium this week. Tu veux que je prévienne la police ou c'est toi qui t'en charge?